Welcome back, everybody, to the Daily Racing Show here at Race Plaza Media. My name is Milan, and as every Thursday, we are breaking it down with what you can watch racing-related this upcoming weekend. As always, if this is too much information or you want to see it visually, on our website, raceplazamedia.com, we have our free racing calendar for the month of July. We're already working on August, so that is coming up very, very soon. But very importantly, very important on that calendar, we break down what you can watch, when you can watch it, and very important where you can watch it. Um, also, it's completely free. You don't have to sign up. You just download it. You click on it. You watch racing. Very, very easy. Very, very cool. Now, let's get into this upcoming weekend. We're going to break this video down in two separate categories. We're going to talk about the free stuff that you can watch and then the paid stuff. Once again, I'm not going to talk about every single thing. I'm just going to highlight a few things. Let's get into it. Free stuff. So if you're a big fan of open seat racing, single seater racing, something that looks like a formula car, I have good news. There's a lots of free racing this upcoming weekend. We have Formula 4, the Spanish as well as the French championship going into a round for this upcoming weekend. We have the GB3 championship as well as the GB4 championship racing this weekend also in Silverstone. All of that you can watch for free, which is really, really awesome. What else can you watch for free? There is the uh, Ferrari European Championship racing this upcoming weekend, as well as the Lamborghini Trofeo Europe also racing this weekend. They're actually racing at the Nürburgring. So if you're a big fan of that track, check it out. Also, who doesn't like to watch Lambos race? I sure as hell don't mind. Now, moving on from that, what else is there to watch? Europe Cup 3 going into round 6 this upcoming weekend. British Touring Car Championship as well as the GT World Challenge Europe Endurance Cup is racing this upcoming weekend as well. So make sure to check that out. Moving on to the paid stuff. We have the Arcar Menard Series. Um, so Arcar 200 racing at the Salem Speedway. Also the Arcar Menard Series West racing at the Shasta Speedway. So if you're a fan of that, check that out. Also, if you're a fan of drag racing, we have the NHR Mission Foods Drag Racing Series racing this upcoming weekend. I've actually never watched a drag race. There is a drag race strip not too far from where I lived. But the last time there was a drag race, it was quite expensive to ex attend. And so for someone who had never watched it, I was like, that's a lot of money to spend on something I'm not sure if I'll like. So if you're a fan of drag racing, let me know if I missed out or if you recommend me watching anything specific. Moving on from that, of course, we also have something that we added more recently to our calendar, the World of Outlaws. They have their sprint cars and their late models. They're both racing this upcoming weekend. And then, of course, we have Formula 1, 2, and 3 returning this weekend in Belgium. We'll be racing at Spa. This is the last race for Formula 1 specifically before going into the big summer break. Um, we already have news going into this upcoming F1 race actually. Max Verstappen received a 10 place grid penalty for um, getting another engine part replaced. You usually can replace it I think once or twice but he's already on his third one so for that you do get a penalty which I think will be very interesting because of course he wants to win. He wants to extend his championship that championship lead that is currently shrinking to Lando. So um, very very good race. Make sure to check it out. F1 is probably currently having one of the best seasons in a couple years. The last two years were really the Max Verstappen show so it's really nice to see good racing especially because the fastest car on the track is currently a mclaren and we haven't been able to say that in i don't know years so make sure to check that out however there's more paid racing so if you want to spend money guys i got i got you the porsche super cup is also returning this weekend they usually race the same weekends as f1 because they also race at the same um, track if you have a f1 tv membership it is already actually included and there is the same as f2 and f3 so make sure to check that out um, nascar canada series is actually racing this upcoming weekend so if you're a nascar fan check it out or if you never watched nascar check it out um now also we have the fim motocross world championship racing in flanders also in belgium this weekend so make sure to check that out and I think that's actually all I have for you this weekend. It's not that much racing, but it's still a lot. As always, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Like and subscribe. Um, check out our website, raceplazamedia.com for, once again, our free racing calendar. Um, 
let me know in the comments what you'll be watching. I know for sure I'll be watching F1. I'm probably going to be watching F2 as well because it's becoming increasingly important to check out F2 not only because it's good racing, but there's a lot of guys that are lined up to potentially be joining the F1 grid. If it's not next season, maybe for 2026. So if you want to get to know those guys, check it out. I'm also going to try to watch some GT racing because I love GT racing. And there is a uh, Endurance Cup this weekend at the Nürburgring, as I mentioned earlier. So I might check that out as well. Anyways, thanks for tuning in. And I'll be seeing you guys here on Saturday with a new video. Bye-bye.